Grade 4 math number 44, multi-step division word problem. And take a look at this. We've got a bunch of biologists. There's eight of them, and they're on a ship, and they're going to go out to sea and do some ocean studies of fish and the plants. All right? So we have eight marine biologists. They're going to set out to study the ocean together, and they packed a total of 624 pounds of food for the trip. If each biologist eats six pounds of food per day, how many days can they stay at sea? So each biologist eats six pounds of food per day. They packed 624 pounds of food aboard the ship, but we want to figure out how many days they'll be allowed to be out at sea with that amount of food. So here we have our 600, our 20, and our four pounds of food. See? So knowing that they each eat six pounds a day, Let's figure out how many eight marine biologists can get each of this 624. And when we find out how much of the 624 is theirs, we'll divide that amount by six to figure out how much they're going to have that'll last how many days, OK? So we have 624 pounds of food and eight biologists. So first, let's figure out how much each biologist gets out of this big chunk, OK? So we have 624, and we're going to divide it by 8. So 8 can't go into 6, but it can go into 62, can't it? 8 goes into 62 seven times. So we put the 7 above the 2, because that's what we're dividing into, not the 6. It goes up here above the 2, and 8 times 7 is 56. And we subtract that from this amount. 62 minus 56 leaves 6. Now it's the 4's turn to come down, and 8 goes into 64 8 times, because 8 times 8 is 64. We put that underneath here and subtract it, and we get 0 remainder. So we know they're each going to get 78 pounds. Each biologist, each of these 8 biologists, is going to get 78 pounds out of this 624. But they eat 6 pounds a day. So we need to split up this 78 pounds that belongs to one biologist into six pound groups so that she knows how many days she'll be able to be out there, OK? So how many times can six go into seven? One time. And that six times one is six. We put it right directly above the seven, because that's what we're going into. We do our subtraction. We get a one. And now it's the eight's turn to come down, see? And the 8 comes down, 6 goes into 18, 6 times 3 is 18, see? And we put our 18 down here, 18 take away 18 is 0, we have a 0 remainder. And there'll be 6 packets of, there'll be 13 packets of 6 pound food, see? So one biologist got 78 pounds out of that big group of 624, and split into six pound groups, there's 13 groups. So that means each biologist has enough food for 13 days. Unless one doesn't eat as much or one eats more, then it could last different. But if we kept it at a constant, that they constantly ate six pounds a day, then they'd be able to be out at sea for 13 days. See? So we took the information. We had to do division twice, didn't we? See that? And we can check it. 13 days times 6 pounds is 78, 78 pounds of food. And if you multiply that by 8 biologists, that's 624. So we know we did our math correctly. See? So you want to read the word problem carefully. You want to circle or underline or highlight any important amounts. You want to draw a diagram if you need to. You want to write an equation that uses the important information, and then solve and check the answer. And it's really important to check the answer because you don't want to do all this work and then find out you get it wrong, OK? So drawing a diagram, you don't need to draw the boat, but you could draw the squares for the food, right? OK? So we split the 624 between the eight marine biologists and got 78 for each biologist. And then we split the 78 pounds of food into six pound groups. And that told us that there were 13 days that they'd be able to stay out at sea. OK? All right, I hope this was helpful. And we're going to go on to the next video.
and I hope you have a great day. Bye.